السلام عليكم صباح الخير. This is a vision question for CIS 1103. Can you see it on the screen now? Okay, identify the component of the computer that is responsible for performing arithmetic and logic operations. Which one? CPU, yes, central processing unit. The main benefit of a computer is to D. Actually, it will do it will do all this. But we ask you what is the main benefit or the main the main benefit is to give us useful information. <coughs> But all are correct. This one is not relevant. What address contains colon, letter, and row number in Microsoft Excel? What do we call it? Cell address. But you don't need this for the Excel. OK. What is? La correct definition of the internet, there is one more. It is all of them, yes. It's the mother of all networks. Who gave us the idea that a program can be stored in an electronic memory? Google it. Who discovered this? Google it, Shalom. It's not Bill Gates, it's not Steve Jobs. It's John Newman. I just John Newman. Okay, he's not famous, huh? Yeah. Uh, latest generation of computer uses which uh, uses which kind of technology? So, other she other trend with computer AI. Yes, artificial intelligence. Very good. AI. So this one is AI. This one is John Newman. This one is all options, I think it was. OK. Choose the main unit of the computer from the following options. Which one is the main unit? Yeah, this one will skip, but it's not part of this course. What is physical parts of the computer that we can see and are called? Hardware. Hardware. And you can see or they call it tangible. Tangible, you can touch. Tangible. Okay. So in the exam, they might tell you, you can see or you can. It's tangible. Okay. Set of instructions given to an electronic machine for a specific task is known as? Software. Mm -hmm. 
which of the following is the main memory of the computer? RAM. Which of the following is the most powerful computer which provides services to other computers connected with it? Powerful computer. Yeah, now you don't know this because I think this is, we used to call these mainframes. It's also mentioned in the book. Mainframes, computers, they are big computers designed that like data centers. So other computers are connected to it. Okay. Like they used to be in the universities, government ministry. Is it uh, the mainframe and the server the same thing? The mainframe is bigger, supposed to be bigger, handles more. One server cannot handle many things. Computer literacy day in the world is celebrated. Yeah, Which application software is used to access web pages and websites? I think one of you just mentioned. Browser, Shabba, browser. Give me an example of browser. One of your colleagues today mentioned Chrome and Microsoft Edge. What else? Firefox. Firefox, Mozilla, yes. What else? Safari. Safari, yeah. Good. Okay, this one now. Unauthorized access of other users' personal data is known as? Hacking. The computer directly understands only what? Code. Zero or one. There's something missing here. This is actually, I don't know how to write it here. Zero. Oh my God, horrible. It is zero or one, okay? The computer only understands zero or one or binary. Windows OS is a product of which company? It's not Tesla, right? Which part of the CPU performs mathematical operations such as addition, subtraction, and multiplication, arithmetic unit, or we call it arithmetic logic unit, ALU. ALU, the exam like ALU, same like AU. Ah, the sar, yeah, yeah, so abbreviation, yes. ALU, arithmetic unit. Arithmetic here, the term means, you know, arithmetic is what? Do you know what's arithmetic? Mathematical, yeah. So the answer is? Which software is used to open and send emails? Browser, because you go to the browser, there are some web mails, right? Should I ask you, do you know? Internet service provider. Give me an example of internet service provider here. Yes. Which of the following is a non-volatile memory? Non-volatile memory. 
Which one? Very good. D. Choose the modern file system used in MS Windows. Nowadays we use NTFS, okay? There is even now more advanced uh, file system. Worldwide, oh, sorry, www is abbreviation of what? Yeah. Finance was kind of all the time. They used to call it the World Wide Wait when the internet was slow. <laughs> the World Wide Wait. Okay. So it is the World Wide Web. All right, choose the secondary storage device. Hard disk. It's all of them. It's actually all of them, Shabab. Okay. When you turn on your computer, when you turn on your computer, the CPU seeks first instruction from the memory to start the system. Very good. Directs and manage different computer hardware components, operations, and control them. Yes. Operation system, our operating system. Which? Yeah, this is not related to our course. Another name of junk email is? Spam. Okay, the the correct full form of ALU arithmetic and logic unit. Okay. No, B is union. That's <laughs> not union. Okay. Yeah. Who was being given the title of father of computer? We will not ask you this question, but it's good to know this. Which one? Hey, did you look it up? John Newman discovered how we can store a bit in the in the in the on the computer on a, on a device like the how you can store it. Okay. Choose the full name of email. Electronic, Electronic mail. Sorry. After processing input, computer gives us some useful information called output. Yes. Then we can store. Now choose the volatile and temporary memory of the computer. Which one? RAM. 
RAM stands for what? Random access memory. Okay. We'll stop here, just take a short break and we'll continue, but let me check.